Hello friends, Sentinel H here, and with something like really, really interesting. So the server for the uh, fusion plant build just went completely bonkers. It, it's you know, it was crashing so much, uh, it was so frequently that we just couldn't keep playing. So since yeah. I only got 15 minutes of footage, that's not long enough really for enough, for you know what you guys have come to expect 30 minutes. So I uploaded that, and now. We, we're going to get this. So, me and Shiva jumped into a, a multiplayer a match of Factorio. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Did you make yourself a pickaxe, to... Shiva? Uh, you should make yourself actually. a pickaxe before you do that. Yeah, because I forgot about that. Let's see, tools. Where is it? Where is it? It's on the, the second one there. Yeah. I made me two by mistake. Right. Yeah, let's see. <laughs> this is so cool. I can't put. Yeah, it's weird. All right, now I'm gonna head over to some iron. Yeah, I'm go there's a little copper. patch of iron right here, not too far away from the coal. We should, we should hit this first. Yeah, I'm gonna go find some. I'm gonna go hit copper. You can hit that. I'm gonna go hit some. I'm gonna go mine up some copper by hand. And see if I can make some stuff. Like I'll make the the feeding of the machine. Well, we, we, yeah, we want to get to electric as quickly as we can, so that we can start. Uh, so that we don't need like uh, uh, the coal. Get to yeah, so I'm copper. get to electricity. Give me that. There's a lot of oil in the area too. If you look at the map. Yeah, since we don't have a lot. Of, yeah, so so here's here's our situation, you guys. There's like no coal around here at all, but there's like oil, like a lot of it. So we what we're gonna, I guess, if we, what we want to do then, is build up to, oil as quickly as we can, and then start use and then produce solid fuel and start using that. Mm -hmm. But well, first, we better get the fences up because oil production is kind of really. Well, we're gonna have to get a turret up soon anyway, because uh, our 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 pollution level is gonna be quite high, and, and there's a biter base just to the right of us. So, um, yeah. So let's see. Well, of course, we need to get research to get turrets, right? Uh, yeah. Well, um, yeah, we need to research uh the turrets. So we need to get to red science. We need to, we need to make red science. You can start making red science. All you need is uh, you need gears and you need uh, copper plates. So if you just get yourself a bunch of iron and copper plates, you can start making some red science. Well, I want to start getting the power generation started actually first. Yeah, you're gonna need to do that too because you know. So I got some that. I need to get a some coal. Wait, where did the wood chest go? I made. I am going to. Jigger this. Okay, what's the I'm, what's the pickup button? I forgot. Uh, you you hold down F to pick things up on the ground. I have rejiggered this so that it will uh, re refill, re refuel the mining drill. Yeah, that's what I was going to think. That's what I was thinking of doing. Yep. So now it will uh, it will continuously refill the mining drill, so we don't have to okay. worry about that. Boiler. Where's the pumps at? What I need for pumps? I need electrical circuits and circuits need copper. Yeah, you need some copper plates. You need three copper plates. Well, okay. I have. Wait, where's my furnace at? Oh, I just burned it into that. Oh well. I can get stone easily. There's a lot of stone in the area down below on their side of the Yes there is, quite a lot of stone. The thing is we'll still have to have a fuel for these uh, furnaces. Because uh electric furnaces don't come for quite some time. Well we can all auto fill them. Actually I find those furnaces are sometimes better than the electric furnaces and a lot more pollution efficient. Now, electric furnaces are really, really nice, especially since they're fast and you can power them with solar later. And can you, you can upgrade them. Yeah, you can put upgrades in them. Well, the steel furnaces now look really cool uh, from what I saw in the dev diaries. And I love the new like uh, the new um, technology icons. They just look mm -hmm. so good. Yeah, I haven't seen those yet. So Yeah, I just hit T. Hit the T button and check them out. Oh, that's a lot better. I know they look a lot. Not only was it was it a lot, it was also a lot smaller. Yeah, they were they were just placeholders. This thing looks awesome. Mm -hmm. Now the next thing that they say they're working on is a actual tech tree. Mm -hmm. So it won't just be like a giant list. It'll actually have a organization to it mm -hmm. to help you uh, decide what to make, what to do next. I need some plates here. Oh, I took them all out. I can give you some plates. Yeah, I I got. I just need ten at least. 
Okay. And you get some... Right. So I can make a steam engine. Do you need a steam engine? I already, I'm already working on that. Sweet. I just need to make a few gears. As long as you have the resources, five. you can just click the the uh, thing and it'll auto craft all everything in between. So you don't have to yeah, make I need, the gears. I need more iron plates. Give me all your iron plates. How do I give them to you? I think you can just drop them somehow. How do I drop them on the ground? I don't know. I don't know how. I'll put them in his chest. There you go. They're in the chest. Why is there a furnace there? Uh, I'm about to cook something. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> this is great. Playing Factorio multiplayer is this is fun. Yeah, so we're just testing this out, guys. But uh, let's let you think about it. So I'm just we we just wanted to test this out to fill the uh, the the wait what we should call it a content gap. <laughs> yeah. It's a bit of a content gap. Now how do you rotate? There you go. All right, I need to get me some stone. Now see, the cool thing about this is that we can use burner mining, our, once we get the electric drills, we can use our burner ones just for, for coal, because they can refuel themselves. Well, we got the um, power plant going. Right. So then you get some pipes and boiler set up. I'm putting it right next to the coir so it's easy to automate. Where were you making copper plates at? Um, right up here by the coal. Because we don't have, like... I just wanted to because because basically I just want to get something quick to coal because I'm doing the burners mainly for currently. Do do do. Let's get a few. Do do do. It's dark, baby, dark. Get inserter. There we go. It's Let's dark, baby. It's dark. Dark, dark, darkity dark. There we go, and some conveyors. What am I missing? Do you have any more iron from the thing down there? I do. What do you need? Um, I need to make a veyer so pipe the cock the coal down to here. Oh, I can I can just grab I will just make the conveyor. Actually, why don't we see about moving this a little bit more south? Down to closer to the thing. Actually, can we make the electrical ones yet? I just made an electrical one. I'll put it right here. Put it like right here. I'd rather just use burners for the coal. We're gonna have a bunch of burners that we don't need anyway. And since the, the since the coal ones can refill it themselves from their own supply, I, that's what I I think it makes sense for now. Well, I think it'll be a good idea to move this a bit more closer to the. Power yeah, sure. Generator. When I was doing my steampunk build, I I, uh, I I created several methods of doing this that uh, worked pretty well. You've got this uh, inserter turned the wrong way. Uh, no, actually, no. Oh yeah, I do. Yeah. I Besides, you can, you should always use you can always use burners for um, these. Um, you could, you didn't have to pick it up. You just rotate on the ground. Well, I I prefer to use burners for these because we don't you know. Actually, it's gonna be running straight off the power plant. That's, that's oh, but if we use point. if we use burners, we don't use our electricity, and they refuel themselves anyway. I mean, yeah, whatever. I'm trying, I'm trying to minimize pollution because remember the burners. Yes. You don't want to attempt to do. It. Yeah, I'm just. We have the burners, so I figured, why you know, use our good stuff when we can just use them in these places. That's my thoughts about it. Oops, excellent. Need one of those. I'll make a couple more of uh, transport plant things. Oh, just yeah, that was an excellent build for the iron or something else that we can probably mine later. There we go. I will, however, use the burner right there. There you go. You put forty-three coal in there. Oh, it means more more coal for the react for the, the power. Plant. It's not going to use sure. much. No, we did this wrong. It's, you did this wrong. No, it's got no. You have to put some coal in the burner. You don't have any power to run the inserter, dude. That doesn't work anymore. No, no, it was it was wrong because basically that doesn't work anymore. Down. See? Oh, really? That doesn't work anymore. Now they can pick up off the end of the conveyor. Oh, I guess they changed. They that. did change Remember, that. It's been a while for me. Yeah, they just no. That was just recent. Between the last time I played it and the time I just started back up, they had changed it. So yeah, that's how that works. So what do you want to do? The research setup. Well, um, 
We're going to want to build that stuff. We're going to want to build our main factory down here. We're going to want to build... Well, we're going to want to build our resource harvesting down here. And then there's this giant open area up here where we can build our actual factory. If we want to ship everything up here with conveyors. It might be better to use a train later. Um, but in the mean, anyway, the first things first that we should be doing... I just built an electric uh, mining drill, so I'm going to place it on the iron and start uh, yeah, and then piping, run, some, yeah, then. run some uh, thingies, run some cables down here. There's the best place to put it, 5.8, and it'll take the entire vein. So this will mine the entire vein, which is great. Trying to be I've got plenty these. of wood, uh, but no copper to make uh, electrical poles. Oh, there you go. If you um if you if you want to place those in a straight line, uh, a cool thing you can do is you can hold down the build button and then just start moving, and it'll auto place at the farthest distance. But that yeah, only works okay. when you're going straight. See, One more should do it. it. All right, we got uh, production going now. Yeah, I got 17 left over. All right, so our furnaces are going to need coal, so we're going to want to put the furnace setup over here. Mm-hmm. So that it can have access to the coal. So what we can do so is if you if you ahead? move this electric pole, we can just keep running this conveyor. So if you if you move this pole like Yeah, I think I know what we can do here. So put that there. And put that there. There you go. And 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 this one. Move it down a bit. And this one. Hang on. Because I, I want to run the, the conveyor just straight to the right. Have to do a double pole here. We're going to need a lot of uh, conveyors for this. I'm going to make 14 batches. Mm -hmm. Even that might not be enough. Yeah, I'll see about poking the biter nest. See if we can't weaken it. You can't. It's, so, it's a big one, dude. It's not a small one. It's a big one. You'll get completely well, ruined. I have yet to see it. Yeah, you'll get completely ruined. I'd like to build a tank soon. Oh, it is a big one. Tank is not soon. <laughs> Tank is I'd like, the, to get, I'd like to get the tank. The tank though. isn't something we can do soon. Now, do you have more? Uh, do you have more um, furnaces? Uh, I accidentally cooked it again. What do you mean cooked it? Oh, I can make two more. For now, we can just put it here, um, and I'll chuck some coal in it. And then we need to get a copper first going too. Yeah. Get, do you have an inserter? Uh, let me see if I can build one. I don't have the copper. Uh, I'm missing iron. Well, plate. or the iron. So we'll just have maybe. to load this up manually. Yeah. I'm going to take this uh, burner mining drill and this uh, wooden box, and I'm going to go put it on the stone. And I'm just going to let it mine stone. I'm going to probably power it with wood. Uh, I'm going to go put one on. Wait, the, where's um, the stone vein? I forgot. Right, by, right, right east of the copper. Okay. Wait, you mean west? Ah, uh, right here yeah, west. was. And we can do this. You've aired up. You know what I mean? I'm gonna run this off wood. Well, we're gonna want to put that over here, I think. Actually, we're gonna. No, actually, actually, right here will be perfect because then it can all pretty much. Well, why wouldn't we do this one first? Like, this copper vein is technically closer to where our production will end up being. Once we get, I mean, if we had access to electric furnaces right away, we could put it wherever we wanted. But we have to, we have to power our furnaces with coal. So. Um, so what do you want to make so insert? Yeah, make, we'll just make an inserter and stick it on on here for now, so that so it's loading ore into this. Um, I need iron plates to make. Uh, it's not. And let's build. I need more copper. There we go. Let me get the copper thing started. What I was gonna do is make an auto pull out. Indeed. We'll hook up an actual decent processing for it. I need more wood. Yeah, that biter nest is huge. I did not like having that so close by. We're gonna have to put up turrets quickly. First, we got automated production. Yeah, we have to. We have to get auto automation first, and in the tech tree, we have to get. We always have to start with automation. Well, since I'm hosting, I think I should get that. Going. I set. I I, I, I set. I, I set it to automation already. We just need uh, 36 iron plates and 15 copper plates to make a lab. 
Yeah, All right, guys. So, um, I hope you'll kind of like this little uh, taste of multiplayer Factorio. We just wanted to make sure that we could get it to work. So anyway, um, hope you don't mind this too bad. I mean, we really wanted to get Fusion Plant recorded um, a full episode today, but it just wouldn't work. We managed to get 15 minutes of it, and then it was just Shiva, you shot me, and it was just <laughs> that's by accident. It was just timing us out constantly. So anyway, hope you're um, not too bummed. We're gonna hopefully figure out what's going on with the Fusion Plant uh, server, and anyway, we'll get back to that as soon as we can. So I'm, I'm Sentinel H, and I'm signing out.